welcome to Erukemi myself Rahul in this series of modern indian history where we discuss the thematic perspective of the previous year's question in the upsc preliminary exam we bring to you a very important theme of modern indian history the theme is british administration the various policies of british and the impact of this policies on indian economy now before moving on to the previous year question and the themes we need to understand the different dimensions which are attached to this topic so the topic of british administration its various policies changes an impact on indian economy so we need to understand what how was the economy of india before the british came to india the village system the urban system what were the imports what were the exports of india how much percent of indian exports contributed to the global economy now when the british came to india we need to understand what was the model of british in india the battle of plassey the battle of baksar where a lot of economic power was gained by the british in india so these are few of the important phases of british east india company into india now when they settled down many land revenue policies were developed by british in india one is the permanent settlement second is the rayatwari settlement third is the mahalwari settlement now when we talk about this land revenue settlement we need to understand from which area where they focusing so this land revenue settlements the area they were focusing what was their main provisions who they were dealing with for example the permanent settlement dealt with the zamindars directly whereas the rayatwari settlement dealt directly with the rayats which was the area how much percent of their total territory in india was under the control of permanent settlement the rayatwari settlement the mahalwari settlement so these are the questions and these are some of the important aspects of the british policies in india now we also need to understand who the founders or the persons associated with this land revenue settlement are now the another point is the impact of this policies on india the drain of wealth theory the persons associated with this economic critic of british policy in india the various dimensions of drain of wealth the territorial revenue the home charges the various interest the various loans taken by the east india company so this form the various drain of wealth theory in india also we need to understand from the point of the impact by the british on indian economy the disruption of traditional indian economy the various policies of commercialization of agriculture into indian economy by bringing different type of cropping patterns into india the bringing of indigo plantation and how this indigo plantation led to various revolts into india the indigo commission was established later on the champaran satyagraha and later on also in the 20th century we see the revolt against the indigo planters so this all we need to understand when we consider this particular theme also the deindustrialization of the indian industries due to the impact of the british policy in india was one of the important factors so this uh, topic is also important when we consider this particular theme now let us understand the theme from the perspective of what type of questions were asked in this themes so first considering 2011 we had the question of drain of wealth and home charges so you see the meaning of drain of wealth the different aspect of drain of wealth the home charges the territorial revenue the loans and the person who gave this economic critic subramanyam ayer gokhale we have dada bhai navroji so all these persons and related views of this persons the books that are associated with rc dat dada bhai navroji this becomes important in this theme so persons associated the various aspects or types of 
drain of wealth and in that time home charges is one of the types so when we learn about drain of wealth do keep these things into perspective while learning we also have the economic critics karl marx and the dialectical materialism theory the various marxist theory that tells that various political historical events are all the result of various social conflicts that appear in the society so this marxist theory and also different personalities view regarding how the british were doing their policies in india and what was the impact in that the views of mahatma gandhi that is also very important because in 2020 you have again a question on how was the view of marx and gandhi ideological so introduction then you have introduction of land revenue system and its impact 2011 there was a question on this so this question uh, has different aspect so the permanent settlement in india the area of bengal bihar odisha where it was implemented it was only 19% of the total british territory in india but also we need to understand who are the person that are associated with this cornwallis then we come to the rayatwari settlement in the madras in the bombay province the person that are associated we need to keep these things into perspective when we study this kind of questions or when we deal with certain questions so when we analyze certain type of questions these things had to be keep in view also mahalwari settlement in the northern india and who were the persons associated with this kind of system the rayatwari settlement and its feature so important feature of that particular settlement or the land revenue policy also becomes very important 2012 we had a question on introduction of various elements by british into india it was a question on the various land revenue policies that were introduced by british into india and how they were introduced what kind of uh, measurement system they were using was it on the same line as the mughals they were using or was it different so you see the depth of the question from certain type of questions when we analyze the theme of a particular question then again economic critic of british into india again when we learn about a drain of wealth theory this drain of wealth theory that was given by various indian educated uh, class so they also were the economic critic of colonialism the british policies into india so many persons are associated with this dada bhai nagroji you see rc dat gokhale subramanyam ayer so the views of this person you need to take into consideration when we analyze certain questions again a question on rayatwari settlement and associated person who were there when this policy came into existence export of the east india company so this is very important uh, dimensions of the various policies of british into india again impact of british economic policy of uh, policy in india so similar type of question again they are asking see the trend is the same they are asking the question on the same kind of things so deindustrialization poverty famines then you have the disruption of traditional indian Uh, traditional economy so this kind of impact you need to keep into perspective while we study certain type of questions also commercialization of agriculture what type of crops were introduced what was the impact of this crops on the indian economy this we need to learn when we analyze certain questions impact of industrial revolution in india what changes were made when industrial revolution grew into india the coming up of various fact, uh, industries into india when jute industry started when the cotton industries came up we had the coming of railways into india and how the working class movement after that also started we need to also keep this analysis into view while we consider this particular theme because many of the questions were also asked 
on the working class movements into in India. Again, indigo plantation in India and the later its impact. Similarly, the ideological question of Gandhi and Marxism, where they say that the economic relation is something on which the relation of the other things that is political, the society is based. So, uh, different views also you need to understand when we learn or when we try to analyze or when we predict that yes, this may be certain type of theme uh, or the sub theme of this particular topics. Be with us at Edukemi. Do subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you get all the analysis, all the planning or the practice of UPSC examinations here at Edukemi. Thank you.